Hey guys, happy Tuesday. How's it going? <laughs> Ugh, what's going on up there? I really can't even tell you. Um, just a whole lot of and clearly no shampoo day hair, uh, hair day. Um, anyway, I'm getting ready, as you can see. I don't know if you can tell because I have the all the lights on. Um, Mr. Flow, Mr. Flow. Um, I have. Oh, I should have put that light on. I have all my lights on because it is nighttime. I think I was getting, I was finishing up in my office, putting these clothes on, getting ready to work out. And I was already frustrated because it was like 6.30. And now it is 7.30 because, Ronnie, I'm going to blame you on this. Um, I'm just kidding. Not in a mean way. Um, I just did, I, I did a phone call and the phone call went long because we were gabbing and then, here it is, 7.30, but I'm not going to give up. I'm not going to not do it because I had a great workout yesterday. What did I do yesterday? What did I do yesterday? Oh, I think I did. That's what I did. I was over I was over at Lifetime, and I took Val, Valerie Waters' um, Action Hero Babe circuit and did it at the gym. I think I'm moving into a phase where I'm going to be doing a lot more work. Um, CrossFit box. I can't wait to go to the CrossFit box, which I found the one that is actually way closer um, down the street and then also at my gym. I tend to go in phases. I've told you guys this. This is what I know about me. Um, in fact, somebody was just asking me about the Insanity workouts and they're like, you know, do you like it? And I said, yeah, I love Sean T, obviously, clearly. <laughs> um, and, but yet I, when I had, when I bought the Insanity DVDs, I never did only Insanity. I don't like to do only P90X. I don't do just Kathy DVDs. Um, I think I can be a lot more shiny object syndrome than most people, um, so I get it, but like, you know, tonight, somebody on Twitter, I, I always put out on Twitter, hey, it's time to sweat, I'm going to go do my workout. Wow. I can feel I did chest yesterday. Um, and somebody goes, what are you going to do? And I was like, hmm, what do I feel like doing? And I didn't feel like running. Um, and you guys know I enjoy running for cardio, because today really I want to have this a little bit more of a cardio day, if you will. Um, but anyway, I'm just saying like, for me, I like to be able to kind of wing it. I like to be able to go through a phase and then mix it up. So if I stop doing, like it was really good for me earlier when I, I started with Val's, um, what did I do first? Bikini Body Express. And then I moved into, did I do? I don't think I did Red Carpet Ready again. I think I did Bikini Body Express. And then I moved into Action Hero Babe. I think I've only done two. Is that right? Because the three ones that she's had out before were Red Carpet Ready, Action Hero Bay, Bikini Body Express. I think I've only done those two. And she has a new one coming out. It's called Hot and Hurry that's available on October 1st. I'll tell you about that later. Um, but anyway, I just, there have been phases in my life where I've really enjoyed working out at home, at my home gym. I'm kind of finding myself getting in the phase right now. Maybe it's just my new house. Um, and the setup here, but I'm finding myself going like this. Oh, I've got to get all my stuff out, which is silly because at my old place, maybe it's just the fact that at my old place, I had a closet and all my stuff was in there and it was like right by my, my, my um, family room and I could just take it out. The way that this house is set up, I love it. I have more space, but I have my weights in my bedroom. Then I've got my, my hardcore weights and my barbell and my BOSU and all the big stuff. It's out in the garage. So I've got my garage stuff, I've got my bedroom stuff, and then my TV is in here. I don't have a TV in my bedroom because I just don't watch TV in my bedroom. Um, so I, I just find myself lately going, oh, I don't want to take everything out. <sighs> Such a drama queen. But um, I do have a feeling. I have a feeling that towards the end of, of this year, I'm going to be spending a lot more time. Number one, I'm going to be traveling. And you all might see some of my last favorite trainer in the entire world, who was at Lifetime Fitness up here, and has hence moved down to Boca, Jay. He's going to be participating and joining Fitfluential, and you just might see him on a lot of videos. Mm. Yeah, he has a channel on YouTube, on that YouTube thing, Jay Deaver, J-A-Y-D-E-V-E-R, if you wanna go. Um, right now he's shooting his videos where he's training with his clients. Um, on his iPhone. I gotta get him a camcorder. We'll hook him up. But anyway, he's badass. He's the kind of guy that he will make you hate him while you're training with him, 
and uh, sorry, allergies. Um, but he will also make you want to work really hard because he just beats your ass. Um, anyway, on another note, because I'm getting ready to work out, I'm getting ready to take this for the first time, so I'm really excited. <laughs> this might sound funny. I'm always hanging around people that if I ask what their supplementation is or they tell me, I know that everybody's taking branch chain amino acids, but I've never really known like what it is or why I take it. So my kind friends from GNC have obviously sent me this, and I'm, I just opened this, and then I had to, before this vlog, I had to dig in and find the scoop because, of course, it's messy and it was, it was uh, buried in there. So I'm taking this for the first time around you. Hopefully it'll taste good. It smells a lot better than, what was that? Oh, the uh, Pro Sculpt from Genetics HD. Remember I told you guys? That tastes great. It smells like crap. Like if you, if you open it up and you're like, hmm, you will literally want to die. Oh, look, it's turning bright red. Um, so this says that you take it, it's five calories, that you take it before, during, or after your workout. Not quite sure they, why they can't just say, take it around your workout. <laughs> um, I'm obviously going to... Hmm. Oh, I didn't even see how much water I'm supposed to put in there. Mix with one scoop. Wait, as a dietary supplement, mix one scoop. See how old I'm getting? With six fluid ounces of water. I have a feeling that's more than six. That's more than six. So this is going to be a little watered down. Because that's... Whoa, I just splashed all over myself. That's 12. So six... Oh, it's just a little over six. It smells like Kool-Aid. Tastes like, uh, I think I did put a little too much water in, but it doesn't have the, um, the bite that you get when you, if you're taking Pro Sculpt. <sighs> this is just very, like a neutral Hawaiian punch or something. Now, that said, I did ask some people, we were doing a Twitter chat last night. Do we have a Twitter chat tonight? Today is Tuesday. I don't know. Anyway, I asked the people in the Twitter chat last night um, about branch chain amino acids because I said that I'm adding two things to my supplementation, branch chain amino acids and probiotics. I took probiotics a long time ago, um, and I certainly know with all the years that I've spent with my a certain medical professional, I'm not going to say anything, um, who had me on antibiotics for two years instead of diagnosing me with hormonal imbalance. Um, um, I, I, I used to take this all the time, and certainly now I know it's more important, but um, luckily I get to try this out because of my um, client, GNC. So they sent me this. I'm going to start with this. This has 25 billion CFUs, whatever the heck that means. We'll explain it later, and we are going to be doing a Twitter chat on probiotics. Um, and then the other one I have in there has 75 billion. That's a lot. How does somebody count that? I don't even know what I'm counting or what I'm saying. So um, this, in addition to my, right now I'm finishing up this, which is a multivitamin. I get these from Trader Joe's, which is magnesium. I'm using, obviously, fish oil from GNC. And then what else? Oh, I get um, from Trader Joe's, I get um, the melatonin that I take at night. I got to go do my workout, you guys. Um, but, oh, a lot of you guys had asked about these. This, are, this is better because I tried to put that picture of oh, the two DVD sets that I got. So this is our friend Madonna. Hold on. See that? And I put, oh, heavens. That's cute. So there's four of these in the set, and then this is the set of Terra Styles, um, which I could not find a preview, a video preview, but it looks like, see, it looks like, um, so one of this says enhance your life with these four routines, this next one says move with ease through over 100 poses, the next one says over 90 minutes of flow to get, <laughs> that makes me think of odd flow to get a healthy body and mind. And then the other one is move with ease, connect with the breath. 
So this one is beginner's yoga for everyone, daily yoga for everyone, complete yoga library for everyone, AM, PM yoga for everyone. So I'm taking these to Fit Bloggin to Baltimore with me this weekend and Carla, Miss Fit Online and I, said that we are gonna do some of this uh, yoga together. Maybe we'll relax and flow together. That sounds dirty. Um, okay, I have to go. I have to work out. I hope you guys have a great week. I have started off the week right. I am also back to, because I'm going to be announcing an end of the year Fit Fluential challenge that we're doing, which is fun. And um, an end of the year, you know, for me, how I want to focus on using the end of the year to build up these shoulders, build up these biceps, build up my butt, get my core, get this mush around my stomach off, all that stuff. It's called accountability. And I'm back to writing everything down. So here's, because um, that's what you gotta do. Um, here's what I did. I get upset when things don't work the way I want them to. Here's Monday, and I'm writing down, did I take my vitamins? I'm writing down what my breakfast was, all the calories. Um, I'm not specifically saying, oh, I want to shoot for this. I'm just curious, like, when I eat enough and I think I should stop, where, where what's my calorie? I, I think I'm kind of staying, um, you know, I'm comfortable right around, let's say, 1,500 to 1,800. We'll see. Maybe I go higher. Maybe I don't go higher. And then um, today, today I've been a little bad. My planning was bad. But see, I need to be able to, <clears throat> and a lot when I come back from Baltimore. Um, I'm not going to buy any groceries because I'm leaving tomorrow. Um, but when I come back from Baltimore, I'm just diving in. Diving in. By the way, oh, I think our paleo chat with Sarah Fragoso, the author of those books, I'm pointing over there to where the books are sitting as if you know that the books are sitting over there. That's what I do. It's all about visual. That chat is tomorrow night. If I'm correct, check on fitfluential.com. I believe that Wednesday night at 8 p.m. is our chat with Sarah Fragoso from Everyday Paleo. You can follow her on Twitter at Everyday Paleo. I'm giving you a hug, but I'm also stretching because I hurt and I need to go sweat. So, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Have a good night. And that's that. <laughs>